Our top story this morning, parts of the southern and central plain states brace for more severe weather today. Violent storms, some with tornadoes and hail, struck North Texas and Oklahoma on Friday. No major damage was reported. No reports of injuries either. The worst weather today is expected in Oklahoma and Kansas. Don Champion is in Oklahoma City with the latest. Don, good morning. Good morning, Vanita. This motel was destroyed by a tornado Wednesday night, but the cleanup effort here has been hampered by three straight days of severe weather. Last night, this area was pounded by hail and high winds. In Norman, Oklahoma, hail and wind at times caused near blinding conditions. Baseball sized pellets even knocked out windows at a YMCA building. Crews worked overnight clearing broken glass. Part of the building also flooded during the storm. The severe thunderstorms marched across the Oklahoma City metro area during the evening rush. At one point, the wind flipped a tractor trailer. Power lines in part of the area were also no match. To the east in the town of Luther, lightning sparked a fire. Heavy rain caused bigger problems Friday evening, creating flash flooding. Several inches of rain fell in a matter of hours in some areas where the ground is already saturated from storms earlier in the week. Some drivers who tried getting through high water simply failed. To the south in Marshall, Texas, flooding was also a problem. The town got nearly three inches of rain Friday alone. Tornado. Yep, tornado. Tornado. At least four tornadoes were reported in the state. The Kavanaugh family in Wise County says one of them lifted their home off the ground, destroying it. We don't have a home. Hi. Don't know where to go. <laughs> Now, the National Weather Service says about 20 million people could be impacted by the severe weather outbreak today. The threat is expected to move east tomorrow. Anthony? Don Champion in Oklahoma City this morning. Thank you, Don.